All right, we are at the Patel residence, and this is for best media room at Cedia for 2015. This is the entryway. Uh, this room was open and it had two columns on either side, which we tore out. And the client's recommendation was, or their only asking point was they want this room to be rustic. And so as you can see here, we put a custom rustic barn door. There's also a Crestron keypad there. And so when you open the room up and turn the light, it turns the lights on in the room and as we walk in the space to the right it is a full kitchen and we actually were the remodeler and the builder on the kitchen with our class A state license and we did all the tile we did the wine with pallets that we cut in half we also used an oak countertop with 10 coats of polyurethane and we did all of this here on the site wine fridge ice maker dishwasher sink you can see we had the stone backsplash with the LED lighting all the cabinets were unfinished that we stained a little niche and of course the beautiful stone wall with LED wax candles that are recessed into the wall and as we move over to the media or cinema side of things, we have a 138 inch vertical masking screen, which the masking is down at this moment, with an iPad on the wall as control. Here's the front row seating of five, the second row seating of four, and then the rear row seating of five as well. We also have the ceiling detail that we put in with custom wood beams that we actually fabricated on site. We also hid the projector into the soffit and used a non-reflective glass and tinted out the box. There's actually an intake and outtake uh, fan. Um, right here you will see that's the intake side. That's the exit fan over here for the exhaust for the projector which is duct work running through here and it's temperature controlled here's a beautiful table for additional seating and this actually steps up and you will see here we did a stone knee wall all the way around the room and along with the stone knee wall up above this is all stretch fabric with acoustical treatments behind here all covered in stained oak wood as trim. There's 12 zones of lighting in this room, all controlled by Crestron. As we walk around here, we also did this knee wall, um, which I thought we, the design elements that we incorporated to match the kitchen countertops, um, I thought was a fantastic idea. As we walk up here to the back row, the last additional five seats and of course this is all acoustically customized with panels behind the stretch fabric and as we get back here and we actually see and again we have the beams and we have two Crestron automated window treatments in the back here now what I think that makes this room really special to top it all off is that this is a Dolby Atmos system with speakers in the ceiling here, 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 and here. We also have a speaker in here, two in the back, and one on the side for the right surround. I really hope you enjoyed the video but I wanted to save the best for last and as we walk out of the room and this room was part of the old kitchen this room used to be a kitchen that we framed up the front wall and this is going to be 
we turn this into an AV room for all of our equipment. And as you open the door, you can see here, we put the hardwoods in, we framed all of this, it's all lit. You can see the two uh, Crestron CAEN cans on the left. One is for low voltage wire, the other one is for lighting control. We actually put in our own sub panel to run the whole media room. And of course we have our two 43U Middle Atlantic racks that feature all of our equipment. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'm actually gonna get you behind the rack. I'm gonna go to the left and I'm gonna show you behind real quick and then we will end the video. So you can see here we used, we piped it down, we came down the trunk and we used lasers. It's a very clean rack. Great thing is, is you can walk completely around these two racks. We put the electrical on the floor to uh, dedicated 20 amp circuits and you can walk completely around the rack. I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, have a great day. Thanks.